Hey, this is Bo here in the Vega Press Room where you can watch, learn, and press on. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new rigid RP350 press tool available from Vega. The Rigid RP350. I have wanted to do a review on this tool for a long time, but I wanted to get it in my hands and work with it a little bit to really see what it could do. And let me tell you, this tool is awesome. It's super lightweight, coming in at seven pounds without the battery. It is super compact and very ergonomic. I mean, just the positioning of this tool and how it fits in your hand and centers itself over your forearm with a jaw installed. It's super wieldy, it's really cool, and it has a lot of really nice features. Couple of things, really cool ergonomic design, completely 360 degree rotating barrel. You can put this tool in any position. It's got a low profile pin for the jaw that allows you some tighter clearance against you know, close surfaces if you're pressing close to a wall or a floor or something like that. Tethering points. It's got a really cool big well-lit switch on the back and right now you can see it's turned blue and if I turn on the Rigid Link app, which I'm going to show you because this tool is Bluetooth enabled, you'll see that it, the switch turns blue and tells you that you're connected to the tool. Something else that's really cool about the tool, it has a, a method in the uh, app called Control Mode that allows you to control the RAM of the tool. So the RAM will advance, it'll come up against the jaw, and then once it sits on the jaw, the tool stops, you squeeze the trigger again and make your press. So if you're aligning things or trying to straighten things up before you make your presses, it gives you a lot of control over the press without locking the press into place and permanently making the connection before you finalize the press. So really cool features of the tool. Uh, something else really nice about the new battery platform, it has onboard power indicators and that really kind of gives you an idea of where your battery charge is and you can make a ton of presses just on one charge. Something else, this tool has an unlimited service interval. So you can make up to 100,000 presses or more before this tool needs service. There really is no service interval. Obviously, if it's getting a lot of use, you may want to have it checked out by a rigid service center, but ultimately this tool can go the long haul without needing any service and that is what makes it really cool. Something else, when you make a press, look at the light on the front of this thing. They call it a work light. This thing is a headlight. I can strap this thing to the front of my Harley Davidson and go on down the road. It is really bright, really well lit. It is all the way around the, the rotating barrel. You can really see what you're doing. So really nice press tool, really lightweight. It comes in at seven pounds, which is amazing. If you consider where Rigid has come from, the original CT400, it's a 15 pound tool, corded only, and this thing is a monster. It's a beast, it'll last forever, but not super wieldy. The old 320E, the space gun press tool, this thing comes in almost nine pounds, heavy tool. And, you know, of course, it's very dated. The batteries aren't even available anymore. That's really old school. And then the classic RP330. This thing's been around forever. This is about an eight pound tool. No battery, no jaw. So really big. It's physically a large tool. It takes up a lot of space. Finally, rigid redesigned, and you've got the RP340. Really compact, really nice, lightweight tool coming in about 7.2 pounds, seven and a quarter pounds. And, but when you look at this compared to the RP350 from grip to grip, you can see that this tool, the 340, is significantly larger. And this guy is almost the size of its little baby brother, the RP240, which is a compact tool. And if you look at it grip to grip, they're built on the same frame. The barrel's a little longer on the 350, and of course you have more room for a larger battery, but this thing is really compact when you compare it to all the other tools that are out there on the market, plus from where Rigid started with the CT400 all the way up to the, two, the, the new 340, and now you've got the 350. Look for an inline version, the RP351, that is coming soon from Rigid. It's actually on the instruction manual. They show a picture of it right here. So that guy is coming if you're into the inline design. But this is a fantastic tool. It works with the, the booster. You can press everything from half inch to four inch copper, half inch to four inch stainless steel tube, half inch to four inch stainless steel pipe, half inch to four inch black iron pipe, and everything in between, plus half 
up to two inch pecs. So this tool is pretty much, if I were gonna have one press tool, this would be it. Another really awesome standout feature of the Rigid RP350 is that this is a brushless motor, which means there is really no service necessary for the motor. There's no brushes to wear out. So it's really smooth operating, it cycles really fast, and it's a really powerful and strong, durable tool. Now, one of the cool features that is included that you can control through the Rigid Link app or through the tool uh, program button on the back is called control mode. And what control mode is, and I'm gonna cycle it for you right now, if you notice, I'm gonna squeeze the trigger, the tool will advance and it stops even though I have the trigger still depressed. If I squeeze the trigger again, it makes the press. And you can see that's a really fast cycle. So to demonstrate that on a fitting, let's put a mega press fitting into the, the tool and go ahead and press this. We'll use control mode. So this is controlled through the Rigid Link app, which I'm gonna show you next. You can see that now the jaw is locked on and the tool is connected to the fitting, but I can remove my pipe from the fitting. So it's just set on the fitting. And now I squeeze it again and I make my press. So control mode is a really, really nice benefit that you get because you can control what's happening during the press. You can align things and then make your final connection. So it's a really nice added benefit that Rigid baked into this tool. Again, the Rigid RP350, this is the one tool to have. When you first download the app, you'll have to register. So then once you've registered, you open the app and you can find your tool by powering it on. I've renamed my tool, you can see it here, and it's connecting to the tool. And then it'll tell you things like how many cycles. You can toggle on and off control mode. It'll tell you all of your usage information. It will also tell you where service centers are. You can look at support documents. There's a bunch of videos that are connected in the app. You can also go back into your settings function, which is at the home page of the app, and touch the gear wheel. And here you can set up your login preferences, location detection, whether it will locate the tool or not, and also other settings for the app. That's it for our detailed breakdown of the Rigid RP350. For more information, check us out at vega.us. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and allow notifications, and we'd love to hear your comments. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you again in the Vega Press Room.